Welcome to Innovative Piano. I'm Chan Kiet, and let me show you a few ways to explore our lessons and multimedia curriculum. Once you log in, you will be taken to your personal dashboard. Here on my dashboard, I can see the workbooks that I've created, upcoming lessons, as well as new and updated lessons. But before we can create workbooks, let's explore some of our lessons. The first thing we're going to do is to click on Overview over here. And you can see that a menu of content appears. There are a total of 22 innovations altogether. And an innovation, you can think of it, is a unit of lessons. The curriculum starts with Innovation A, which is the beginning level, and it advances all the way to Innovation 17, ending roughly around the late intermediate level. Let's start with Innovation 4, Major and Minor Triads. Here you will see a summary and related videos to the right. These videos will present new concepts or techniques that are taught in this innovation. Below, you will see the core elements and also applications. Let's start by taking a look at technique. Here on a technique page, often you will find a demonstration video. You can of course enlarge the video as well as change the speed of the video. Let's go to another lesson, a reading lesson, for example. Here, what you see are just samples of what the lesson is going to be like. To view the complete drill, click on this. Finally, let's take a look at some musictheory.net lessons, which are integrated with an innovative piano. These lessons are interactive. You can respond and also create a report. Now let's take a look at some applications. In many of our lessons, it is very common to see complementary resources. For example, in this particular lesson, when I'm learning how to play lead sheet, you have melody that you can play along, as well as sample recordings of the, the different voicings that we want you to work on. You can learn more about this team by clicking on this link, as well as a playlist Exploring this playlist of other artists who have performed this tune could be very interesting for students. Now, notice that all of these lessons are grouped according to the lesson types, for example, core elements, or listening, or repertoire. But if you want to have a sequence curriculum, go to Curriculum tab. Here, you can actually customize your curriculum, but you're going to learn how to do that in the next tutorial. Let's click on this tab, Browse Master Curriculum. If you want to explore any of these lessons, just click on it. And the final way of exploring Innovative Pianos lessons is to go to the search engine. Here, you can search for all the lessons within each of these categories. For example, if you want to know what are the repertoire that are available within Innovative Piano, just click on Repertoire and search. Here you get a list of all repertoire within our site, from the easiest to the most difficult. You can also, of course, do keyword search. And to return to where we started, just click on the dashboard icon. On Innovative Piano, there are over 700 multimedia lessons, but now you're ready to get started.